So in the given question we are asked to distinguish planning decisions from control decisions. Distinguish, distinguish planning decisions, planning decisions from control decisions, from control decisions. So uh, we have a five step decision making process, right? We have a five step decision making process, decision making process of which the steps are, let's write each of these steps. So the steps involved in the uh, decision making process is identifying the problem, identify the problem and uncertainties and uncertainties. Then we have the step where we obtain the information, obtain information. Then in the next step, what we do is we make predictions about the future with the information that have been obtained. So make predictions about future and after this is being done, we will make some decisions, right? We will make decisions, we will make decisions by choosing among by choosing among different alternatives choosing among alternatives alternatives since at this step we can see that decisions of different types uh, comes from different individuals so we make decisions by choosing among the alternatives that we have and the last step is to implement these uh, decision implement the decision implement the decision implement the decision evaluate the performance evaluate the performance performance and to learn so the reason we discussed the five step decision making process is because in the first four steps what is happening is that we are planning to make a decision right so this is what we call planning decisions planning decisions and in the last step of of the decision making process what we do is we include uh, they includes uh, this includes the uh, action taking right uh, we implement the planning decisions and we decide on uh, the performance evaluation and we learn from the feedback that we receive so this part the fifth step of the decision making process is called the control decision the control decision so in the first four parts, we can see it is planning decisions and this includes the deciding on the different organizational goals, predicting results and the various alternative ways. This is the, in this we discuss the alternative ways of achieving the goal, right? And after this is what we, when we reach the control decision, and in this step it includes uh, taking actions to implement the planning decisions and we decide on the performance evaluation and we receive feedback from the decisions that we have made so this part is called control decision so this is what is this is the difference between planning decisions and control decisions i hope you understood the answer thank you